Stangibalisco here. Today I went swimming at the Spearfish Recreation and Aquatic Center. It's the last day they're open, the last weekday they're open until Labor Day, which is the last day of the summer that they're open. Uh, because of staffing limitations, all of their lifeguards are college students and they're all going back to college tomorrow. Today is the 22nd of August, 2018, and it was a beautiful sunny day, and I got in a good, some good outdoor air and sunshine and a swim. But there weren't very many people there because it was rather cool outside for them, uh, 71 degrees, <laughs> and uh, that that seems that seems cool for some reason to these people. Uh, if it were that way in California when I lived there. A day like this would be a treasure, uh, especially along the beaches. And uh, everybody would be out swimming and be a typical summer day. But not here. I don't know what it is. Uh, but the locker room was empty, except for myself and one other person. And that one other person was right next to me. An empty locker room with probably 500 lockers in it. Two people right next to each other. Now you'd think that can't possibly happen very often. That's got to be a weird coincidence. But have you ever noticed that that kind of thing, especially if you frequent locker rooms that are not full very often or other things like that, things tend to bunch up. Chances. Uh, it, it seemed like it would be very unlikely that such a thing would happen, but yet that almost seems to be the rule rather the, than the exception. Have you noticed that? Uh, in, and in other things, too, storms, uh, hurricanes, tornadoes, things like that, they tend to occur in bunches. Unfortunate events, fortunate events. More often than not, it seems, or more often than probability would dictate, they happen, uh, they, they bunch up. And I thought there must be a, a mathematical reason for that. There must be some rule of nature uh, that has to do with this and that, that, that makes this happen, that you would think that things would be just scattered at random, but they aren't. I mean, have you ever noticed that? You must have. Do you have any ideas as to why this occurs? And other than, you know, it's not the devil at work or anything like that. Finally, when I read the book Chaos by James Glick, I got an idea of why this might occur. That uh, and, and so I would recommend highly that you read the book chaos, if you haven't already. Chaos theory, I think, sort of provides an insight and a reason as to why these kinds of things occur. Why do you think they occur? Uh, have you, you must have noticed it. Comments are open. A dangerous thing for me to do. Stan Gibalisco signing off. Until next time, so long.